Hello friends, this is Mohamed Tauri Zapatel and today we will be going to see how we can share data from child to parent component using add date output decorator. Right? So first, I have the, I have updated my code. I have added an edge heading tag which share data from child to parent component and in our app first, app dash first component, I have created a particular event that is binded with our that is being binding to something in another company okay and it is being calling it is calling add new item which is a particular method i've created you will see the code also so in here the particular event is getting called okay now app dot app dash first component and we'll see about this code also so first in let's see to app dot component dot ps5 no so here i have uh, created a particular items array with the value like alpha beta gamma and theta also i have created an add new item which is being called with using this event right okay so this is the method which is being called here so what we are doing in here add new item i am taking a particular new item and i am pushing or adding the particular new item in our array list okay this is the parent part but from where the data is coming so the data is coming from child okay sharing the data from child to parent component so we will go to our first dot component dot html that is our child component right to samjha ha nahi to samjha nahi so here in here sharing data from using output decorator i have created an input type of text and a particular button here also i have to tell you that i have Used a particular I given a particular ID to our input type that is item dash input, and I have referenced it to our input type with a name new item. Hashtag new item is a particular reference so that it whenever a particular reference is used in other elements of HTML, if we get new item, it will be a reference that the value is coming or going to our input type. Okay, text. So here the particular reference is being used, right? And here I have also created a particular button, so the type button only. And also here I am I have created a particular event of click. On clicking the button, the particular method that is add new item, which is taking the particular value from input type, and it is on submitting it, the value is being passed in the method. So what's in their method? So here in first dot component dot as file, the value is coming in our method and it is being getting emitted, which is you can say it is saving the particular value and it is emitting it in an event. The use of add date output decorator is to pass the data from child to parent component. So the value is coming. Okay, the value from here. The value I am putting it in here and clicking the button. On clicking the button, get the value passed to method, and from method it is being emitted, it is being stored in our event variable, which is decorated with an output added output decorator used to pass the data from child to parent component. So using added output decorator, the particular value is being getting passed from child to parent component also. The emit method is used as our event property is of type event emitter. Then now why we have to use event emitter? We want to emit or we want to and it's an emitter so that a particular event whenever a particular event gets created, this will emit a particular this class is used to store the particular event or the particular value in it that's why we are using this thing so our event is of a type event emitter which is also of a type using string and the value is getting passed and getting stored in an event and the particular value using a direct output decorator is getting passed to a parent component so how in our parent component i have used this also okay so whenever the value is getting passed okay the event is being binded with our click method with our method okay 
So here in add new item, the value is coming. It's getting from it's getting shared from child component that is from here to our parent component, and in parent component the value is getting pushed in the items array list, and that's how the particular value is being getting displayed because I have used ng4 in our list. It's coming. It's getting from it's getting shared from child component that is from here to our parent component. And in parent 